leave this one this one has got evil altars this one is a better one no witch will enter them it's only for you it's only for you your husband is there your wife is there your promotion is there I declare it's your time Right, running very fast to the word of the Lord. Uh, into our text, uh, Ephesians chapter number one. Uh, we carry on with the verse, verse number seven. Verse yes, number seven. In the name of Jesus Christ. I greet uh, Pastor Casey. I greet you, man of God. is busy doing the work here. We have been working, guys, on media side time in these days like never before. Let's give God the praise for the men. And all the media guys, we thank God for them. We thank God for people who have been preparing the temple uh, as we are to open. Thank you, Jesus. came uh, and he was full We thank God so much. There has been a, 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 a amazing grace upon the saints. Nobody was pushing them. They were just moving. Not a special department of men. They were moving like never before. Thank God for support during lockdown. All the sons of the ministry, we thank you so much. Mama Dola, we bless the Lord. During the lockdown, Everything was in order, guys, and everything is still in order. Uh, please forgive us on Bay TV today. There is a, 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 a mistake that is not a mistake. They are upgrading their work. So there was a skipping off because their system now, the Bay TV is. It's, like, it's gonna be like SABC One. TV One. Free to air. So now it's a, it's a, there was that skipping of as they are programming the work. So we learned the program here to so because has of shifted in the system. So they are going to tell us when will this gonna be playing? Maybe. Uh, tomorrow, I don't know, but we're still gonna use seven o'clock. But the system has skipped everything. So if Bay TV is upgrading to be like SAPC one, it means there is growth. So, and I pray that to all our sons of the ministry, let them understand that media is what we have to possess. Please, we urge again the sons to buy smartphones. Because the, Jesus is more important than Tilili. And now you are thirsty. And God knows that the time we live in demands this. Offices are going to be closed, guys, because of uh, 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 departments, because work can be done through computer. So there will be shortage of jobs. So people are going to work in their houses. People are going to be teaching through these things. So we rather prepare ourselves. A church is the only place to prepare people to grow. So, the problem of, uh, of doing things in time, time doesn't respect you. 
And again, the issue of time, it doesn't care what you need. But the time says what is needed now is this. If you don't have the time goes on. So I pray that guys, we won't support uh, 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 excuses yet we die. Because I know you will say, I don't work, I'm not doing this, and, I, and yet the time is going. So when you join, when you accept the time, God will perform wonders in your life because you are updated. We are praying for those who don't have cell phone. We are praying for uh, the grandchildren to teach the old people how to use, how to go to Facebook. And we have to connect now here on eight channels of all this that we are using Twitter, Twitter. YouTube and Facebook, those so are go, the working ones. So connect which channel is this? Any challenges is pause or this one? We need to connect the So we are using now four. We are left with four. Why do we connect to these things? It's because people stay in Facebook. People stay in Twitter. People stay in Twitch. There is no person just. That's why when you are walking on the mall, you see somebody putting earphones. It's not here. He is there. So, we are pushing the gospel to where people are. So Tina see I call it gospel. You fake a apple or a band. The devil will never be where there are no people. The devil stays in the river where people come. So we have to bring the gospel there. So gospel Somebody say amen. amen. Otherwise, we thank God so much for this growth on uh, accepting media. Because it's a time. That's why there is also a church started in Cape Town through media. Somebody say amen. amen. Somebody say amen. Say amen. Right, let's read. It says, read, verse 7 and 8. Verse 7. In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the riches of God's grace that he lavished on us. With all wisdom and understanding, he made known us he made known to us the mystery of his will according to his good pleasure. Say, Lord Jesus, it us, yes. I receive your word. Bless it in the wonderful name of Jesus Christ. We are speaking more of what God is going to do now. As we are from the lockdown, and as we celebrate our 10th anniversary, so in the conference, conference, the important thing is to empower each other so that after conference, Friends, we are released to go. We also give report of what we have done in conference. So it's so important to know what God is going to do. So the Lord said, as we said yesterday, God has redeemed you. God has chosen you and God is sending you. So these three things they are very very powerful when you are a son of this ministry. It's going to align you in the move of the Lord. We spoke that day in the beginning of the conference about the heavenly vision that the heavenly vision is not owned by people 
It is owned in heaven. It is ruled in heaven. But it is on earth. We said, this vision Lombono. is a vision of raising men to be like God. It is in the vision God said, let us make men in our likeness. This is the vision that accommodates people who were born long ago. Uh, who are still going to be born. Who are still living. Whoever is born failing to raise men into the likeness of God, he is far from the vision of God. We said this vision is a broader vision. Is measured by eternity. It is from eternity to eternity. All people are joined in this vision. Somebody say amen. amen. Somebody say amen. amen. We said every believer has to grasp that vision because when he grasped that vision God is with that person somebody say amen somebody say amen and then we moved on and we spoke about the redeemed church which is what we spoke about yesterday the redeemed redeemed church because the church according to God is a redeemed organism is already redeemed but there is a work that must be done for them to live in the life of being redeemed. That is why some are born again as you said, but they are not redeemed. So God says as from today you are redeemed. That is why you, you nearly die. Something nearly killed you. Some of you are from hospital. They have been on ICU but you are redeemed. Somebody say amen. It is amen. Somebody say amen. It is amen. Some are still going to be redeemed. As we are dealing about these three things. You are redeemed. You are chosen. And you are to be sent. Somebody say amen. It is amen. So we said. Redemption. It means. You are brought back. Jesus yes. he paid the price Jesus yes. paid he paid through his blood to redeem you and me the price of the blood of Jesus was enough mm. it's still Enough. There is no better price except the price of the blood of Jesus. So in these days, God is going to see the work of the blood. Lives are going to be redeemed. Not by laying of hands, not but by the power of the blood. Hands will not reach every area. But the blood of Jesus that was shed 2,000 years ago is going to deliver many people. Somebody say, Amen. Somebody say amen. It's amen. So redemption 
It's needed more after Corona. We must be redeemed. Lives of people must be redeemed. Churches must be redeemed. The nation must be redeemed. Children need redemption. Finances need redemption. There is a lot that needs redemption. Our minds, they need redemption. Why? There is sinking. There is sinking of life. Lives are sinking. The economy is sinking. Cities are sinking. Families are sinking. What is needed is redemption. So our city, they must be redeemed. And the Bible says, in him we have redemption through only the blood. Only the blood of Jesus. I believe in the power of the blood. Now, one thing the blood will do. Thank you, Jesus. Which is the main purpose that has caused families, nation to sink. It is sin. So the power of the blood it's going to erase sin in the world. Why? The wages of sin is death. Nations are dying because of sin. Churches are dying because of sin. So God came to you, sons and daughters. He said, In you, you don't have sin. You must not have sin. You must not have because you are redeemed. In other words, to you, you will measure by purity. To redeem others. You will major. You will major. By prioritizing. By purity. So that. Other nations. Will be redeemed. When you master that. Mm. You are not going to sink. The redeemer doesn't sink. He takes others out of sinking. One who is sinking cannot redeem others. So God is looking at church a redeemed church a redeemed church we said the churches are saved but salvation we use the name for, for, for a person to be saved but in redemption, Jesus uses the blood. So in salvation, they use the name. We use the name. And it is biblical. The Bible says, but there is no other name on earth given to a man to be born again to be saved except the name of Jesus. So when Jesus saves he will use his name. In the name of Jesus we are saved but in redemption he provides the blood. That is why when the children of Israel were in Egypt 
Israel for them to be redeemed there was a blood to be shed God instructed them he said let every family slaughter a lamb and let this blood be applied on every door frame so the angel of the Lord will be hovering and God will be killing every firstborn so the blood is for redemption when you are oppressed when you are bound by a certain sacrifice when your marriage is bound in darkness the name of Jesus will not help but the blood of Jesus will come with you we said that is why you see people they speak in tongues but they are still bound they speak in tongues but they are still demon possessed they speak in tongues but life is difficult what is needed is the blood of Jesus and it's a time to call the blood and I am here today to call the blood to declare the blood in your life in your family in your children let there be the blood the blood of Jesus why why in him we have redemption the moment we apply the blood whatever holds you has to release you whatever holds you when we apply the blood and in this season it's a season of the blood it's a season of the blood I declare the blood the blood of sheep the blood of sheep the blood of sheep it must redeem your life it's going to redeem it must redeem your life from today mm, mm, mm. from today we are not going to lay hands but you have to come out when the blood is applied you have to be free we are not going to preach hard we will apply the blood we will send the blood when we send the blood release will manifest thank you Jesus my knees thank you Jesus I am feeling shaking thank you Lord I feel shaking it's happening I feel shaking I feel shaking I feel shaking I feel shaking this blood in it there is redemption there is one thing that is in the blood it is redemption the devil fears the blood of Jesus that is why we said yesterday when somebody goes uh, he is buying your life he goes to Sangoma oh, yeah. and, and says, I want to kill Mamaneka. I want him to perish. You don't know. Oh, yes. You will pay. He pays for your life so that your life will become. So when he pays, so, he is acting the act. When, sir, he, 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 and you have got no choice you have to become of what he did so Jesus so, yes. he paid wow. so when Jesus died yes. he, he paid the, the blood was a payment so, so, the blood was a payment so when it was released when it was said, Jesus was paying. And at that time, 
You were bound by a satanic evil altar. Witches were holding you. Life was difficult. It was difficult. So Jesus so yes. was hanged on the cross. And when the blood was shed, the Bible says that the dead appeared. Why? They were bound. And the price of the blood so, liberated them. And the Bible says they appeared to it, the temple. It is People who died long ago. So if the blood was able to redeem those people, how much more in your life if you are still alive? So Paul says, in him we have redemption. So we said yesterday, believers must be in him. So when you need redemption, you must be in him. Do not be saved without being in him. You must be in Christ. So Jesus said, hold me. Yes. If you remain in me, not with me, not in Nam, the, the power is in. You must be in. When you are in him, one, one, you are hidden for protection. Number two, two, you are redeemed. So when God moves forward, so he moves with you. If there is something holding you, has got no choice because God is moving. Some of people have got a satanic chain. They are bound by a hook of chains. They desire to go forward, but when they go, God they cannot go. The problem is they are saved. They love Jesus, but they are not in him. So the gospel is difficult when you are in him. But he has got more power and a better taste when you are in him. That is why for you to be in him, Things must change. The devil fears people who are in him. He knows those that are saved who are with God but not in him. So these who are in him, they are not known and understood by the world. They are in him. They are when God walks, they walk. When God thinks, they think. When God sits, they sit. When the devil attacks, God hides them. When God moves, he moves with them. When season change, he walks with them. And that person is you today. You are redeemed. Those people are not like all other people. They are different people. They are carrying three things. They are chosen. They are redeemed. They are sent. They are born again. But they are also in him. They hear from heaven. They don't hear on this world. They don't hear what the world is saying. They've got an ear from heaven. When they apply what the heavens are saying, the world doesn't understand them. Because they are carrying a divine vision. They are doing things that is not understood. The world persecute them. 
Ilizwe. They are insulted by the world. But, but the Lord massage them. They are walking in Queenstown. They walk in Queenstown. They eat here. They live here. But they are remote from here. The Bible says they are not the people of this world. But they are born from heaven. They live in God. They stay in God. They walk in God. They have decided to follow God no matter what. The world can discuss about them. They don't bother themselves. They know that God they serve is the one is the Alpha Alpha is the Omega. They live in the eternal purpose of why they are born. So they live in the eternal purpose. They are not tempted. But but they understand. So these people they are they are in the they were in the plan. They are in the plan. They shall be in the plan. Those are people Jesus died died for them. Those are So when, when the heavens were asking saying whom shall we send? Jesus said here I am send me. In the book of Isaiah chapter number 6. In what year Isaiah chapter number 6. So when Jesus there was in a prophetic way by the prophet Isaiah. So, so, so Isaiah said, Yeah, I am. So when Jesus came, he came and said, I am the bread of life. I am the way, the truth. And the so, life. No more. So these people, Aboban, they do the will of the one who sent them. Benza in tando ya lo oba to me. Even if things are difficult, no ba is into says in They do the will. Even if things are hard, they do the will. Even if things are changed, they do the will. Even if they like to quit, there is nowhere to go. They have to turn around. Why? They do the will. Of God. They don't see God the Father. They are. They represent him on earth. But the father doesn't appear. They, the sons, appear. They go and pray. The father doesn't appear. But the son appears. But the father doesn't appear. So many believers. They pray, looking the father to appear. And yet the father trusts the son. So there is a shifting now. On the sending part, they said, Your father will not appear because you will be a son. So Jesus, when he was sent, the father never appeared. He prayed. What and as the father never appeared. But the son knew what Unyana was that the father is with me. He would say, I am in the father. And the father is in me. So sons Onyana will be in the father. And the father will not appear. You will appear. You will be getting an anointing of facing the devil after redemption. So the, the, the power to face the enemy lays on redemption. So when you are redeemed, you will know 
Uzoyaz. Even if you have not seen him. Even if things are difficult, no but you will know God that He is with me. You don't need signs. God, signs when life you. begins to be difficult, when you are a son of God, when you are a son of God, you, 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 you don't operate by the anointing when you are redeemed. You know, we ask. Your anointing has tend to be a strong knowledge. You know we ask that the father doesn't leave the son. At any time, the father will never leave the son. Father and son is the highest last level of protection. When a son reports, he reports to the father. That is why many people now, when things are difficult, they report to other people. But, but, but the, the, the right place is, is a son reporting to the father. The father has been given the anointing to shelter. The son walk with knowledge that my father has got all power. Even if there are things killing, but they cannot kill my father. So Jesus, that's why he was able to face the devil, able to face death. That's why he was able to face every challenge. He knew his father. He was saying, I am in the father. So when he died sharing the blood he was to make me and you to be like he true redemption so he went there to redeem me and you so now we are sons of God but the church delayed that is why Corona came why sons not know who they are? Some were still bound. Some were looking the issue of salvation during time of redemption. So it was a time of redemption. That is why some of you as I'm speaking there are spirits in them who are keeping them they, they, it's gonna be there for the second attack there is an attack that is going to come but it is laying a foundation on the past attack of a pandemic so these people that you see that they are living some of them are not living because the devil has written them to die on the coming time and how do we overcome the devil's plan we must speak the blood of Jesus to liberate you to liberate you so that what the devil will bring it will find you already released that is why when you walk redeemed one, one, you don't fear. You know we ask that I am a redeemed child. Of God. I am free. You don't fear. You, when we put all these things, it's just obeying. The law. We have to obey the law. But the truth is, our hope and our trust is in the blood of Jesus. So don't trust the mask more than the blood. So the blood of Jesus one, one carries redemption. Somebody say amen. So we said yesterday. We are redeemed out of pits. Out of 
Yes. We are redeemed out of the graves. We are redeemed out of the spirit of the area. They are what we call as the spirit of the area, which is what I want to call it. And it's what I'm coming here today first. The spirit of the area is a dangerous spirit. Many people, they are kept by the spirit of the area. So it doesn't allow people to go far so according to how God wants. It's the spirit of the area. It has kept churches. You find that in a church, the church grows and ends on a certain level. Because the spirit of the area sometimes children don't grow far. They are kept by the spirit of the area. Sometimes businesses they end somewhere they don't go beyond is the spirit of the area and God through his blood he said to us I want this church together with the area to be redeemed from the spirit of the area let the spirit of Queenstown not to hold you not to hold your life be redeemed in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus Rabosha you grow and end in a certain level churches grow and end in a certain level believers grow and end in a certain level when they stand there they say hey there is no God now they don't know that is the spirit of the area but I thank God because here we have overcome the spirit of the area it should never hurt you it should never hurt you you are redeemed in the name of Jesus the spirit of the area doesn't want you to taste new things. Number two, it doesn't want you to get better things. So, redemption, it means God has made you better. So, when a life becomes better, so when you one, one is expensive. So people don't want a better life. So better life comes through redemption. I am called to make you better. I'm not called to dance and dance and dance. And My true calling is you to become better. After keyboard, be better. After keyboard, after excel and go there. It's what I'm called for. So believers through the spirit of the area. That is why many men of God they have lost the calling because they adopt the spirit of the area. So the spirit of the area doesn't want you to fly in a new sky. When you go to a new sky you get attacks. Some see themselves, hey, I'm not going to fit there. Some say, hey, I, now it's no longer Christ the rock that I used to know. It's, it's still the same. But you are living the spirit of the area. So when you leave the spirit of the area, you get to another breeze. To another environment. And then your mind will learn there. And then you learn a new life. Why? Redemption. Made better. Made better. 
Wenzwe ngono. So that when you are made better, that's why the devil wants you to be born again. But he doesn't want you to be better. He loves you when you are born again, but not better. That is why when you are better, many people leave you. It's because it's better life has got more attacks. But the plan of Jesus is only there to secure you when you are attacked. Some of you, their children are going to be better. And when they become better, they are more strong witches to attack them. But the blood that purchases us to better things will protect you. But you need to know that life of redemption is more of you to be better you are purchased to be better. Somebody say amen. amen. So, and I prophesy better things. I prophesy better level at work. I declare better level of understanding in the name of Jesus. So it's redemption. So we said you are taken out of the spirit of the area. The spirit of the area again has got altars of the area where people are bound by the altar. You try. That is why somebody who is attacking you is not far from where you are staying. He's staying, he's watching you. Every day you greet him. Every day we are bullies. But he is attacking you. He goes to a certain altar. And pray and call your name. Midnight he calls your name. Every day he calls your name. When he meets people. He talks about your name. But the blood of Jesus will wipe away. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. That's why I said to you long ago there are people who try to go forward in life. But it's difficult. Why? People around. They get into a meeting and discuss about his name. So you try to go forward. So you are pulled by the meetings. You try. You plan this. It doesn't work. It's an altar of the area. But tonight. I say today, whatever altar that is holding your name, I blow it. It must dismantle. It must fall down by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Fall down. Fall down. Fall down. Down. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Altars of the area. The altars and down. We said they keep you to have a local understanding. You, you, you are a person of this place. You, you, you just look here. Your programs are just around. You think around. I, I feel an anger of the Lord. Christ the rock. Christ the rock. Out of locality. Out of locality. Let our sons be redeemed. Let our daughters be redeemed. Let our sons be redeemed. Be redeemed. 
from the bondages. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. 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 Somebody's coming out. Somebody's coming out. Your son is coming out. Your daughter is coming out. 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 In that altar. I know man shall not shut you. All tapuma. Hey, Zaymozo. Thank you, Jesus. Is Lee Kiza? Lee Koya. Is Lee Songa La? Rosho Kodo. Is this Zonga? Is he Kaya? Out, out. Puma. Out, out. Puma. You altar. You altar. On the area. Release him. Kurula. Hey, the blood. The blood. The blood. Jesus. In him, we have redemption. We have redemption. They like or not, we are in him, we are redeemed. In him, we must be redeemed. In him, there is no one else. He alone is our redeemer through his blood. We are not gonna go to Sangoma. No, 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 uh -uh. no. We won't go. We cannot go to Sangoma. We cannot put shoes off and, and talk, and talk, and talk, to, Toba. And talk to Makosi. No, no, never. We've got Jesus. No, yes. We've got the Lion of Judah. No Lion of he Judah. died for us. In Jesus. His blood no, was blameless. Yeah. Purchased my life. He brought me back. Yes. Ah, la, 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 la. I say, be out. Jesus, 10th anniversary, 10th anniversary, you are coming out, you, we are Puma. you are redeemed, when you must look around, you look your finances, you look your certificates, you look your jobs, you say I don't belong here, I am going to a better place, I am made better by the blood of Jesus. Oh Jesus! You leave the area of Tigolosis. I share in down your Tigolosis. Which and which that cannot hold you? Sickness is of the area cannot hold you. Is in force and down where there is bar. Wizards of the area. They've got enough power to hold our sons. I say the demon of the world cannot hold you. The spirit of the area. Moya went down. Is in him is a cani. It's the spirit of the area. Moya went down. The spirit of the area. Moya went down. A spirit of the area. Moya went area. It operates in the area. It sends a kulonda to keep people. Ukutinaban. But we thank God. God has born with Jesus for His blood. We are redeemed. Satangul. God showed me Queenstown. Uye Sudbon is Queenstown. He showed me, please take this. Ute Tata Land. When God showed me Queenstown, what would you go in Bonisa Ikomani? Queenstown is in a river. Komani is a lange. I saw it in a dream. The bone a pupe. As you come in, the whole Queenstown, truly, this is water. So these mountains are carrying the spiritual waters. So in Taba, as I was watching, I saw a fence beglared. We were on top of the mountain. I saw 
we were standing like this. Sasi meganje. And this is fence. And Lena Lutong. And this is the whole of the river of Queenstown. All people stay here. Inside next to the fence. I saw goats. And the goats were playing on a on a, on a slope like this, you know a goat, it can roll and go up. But when they play, and then at the end of where they can play, there is a deep pit. And as I was watching, and I I saw when you look deep to that pit, you look until your eye cannot see. All these mountains of Esbelen down to, you know, all this is a river. As I was watching, I saw dry water again. And the Lord said to me, what to as I was standing with my wife, I wanted to rescue this goat. Because the goat, I was afraid that is going to get into that pit. And for me to get the goat, I have to come out of this fence. So, and as I was going, the voice said, Many men of God died to that pit. They have been rescuing goats instead of sheep. So the goats are used to trap the man of God so that he goes. I said, Lord, thank you. Where we were standing, there was light all over. But in the pit was dark. I prayed to God. I said, Lord, what does? I said, Lord, what must I do? What about those that are already there? And then he said, redeemed, chosen, to be sent. There are people to be taken out of that pit. As I was watching, I saw a big snake from a distance of the beginning of this place of Queenstown to the end. It's sleeping. It eats at any time it wants. It eats at any because the people are all around. And the Lord said to me, what that is what killed the people of Queenstown. Only the blood will rescue them. Some other families, are there in that pit. They are bound by the spirit of the area. But as we are about to pray today, as we are about to pray today, I pray that your life will be redeemed. And number two, I pray that we release fire to that snake. Let us send fire to the snake then. If your family is there, if your job is there, it's a spirit. It makes prostitutes. It creates poverty. It creates death. It's a snake. 
and go. It stays there. Some churches are buried there. Amanya mabanda fifwe pa. Powerful men and women of God are there. Amato tana manda katiko afifwe pa. People who used to preach powerful gospel are no longer carrying that divine vision. Abanya bantu abebe shuma elivangel abasena yola anto bebe na yokala imkena la nyok. Then the problem is, inagi. How do people become goats? Abantu bantu 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 uh, uh, more than the problem God has concerning your life. The way you worship God is that he must remove your problems. Your problems will go away when you are in the divine vision. God will redeem you. There is one thing that the devil will not hold. It's a divine vision. He has got no power. In the divine vision, there is your breakthrough. There is your healing. There is your miracle. In the divine vision, there is all that you need. So a redeemed church. So listen here. As I go, was going today with my brother. The Lord spoke to me. He said, "There is a better Queenstown. Queenstown and not this one. Not It is there. And he said, "I will take them to a better Queenstown." The Lord said to me, "There is a better South Africa. It has got no corruption. It has got no corona. It has got no dirty. It is there." I said, "Lord, how will you do it?" He said, "I will redeem this to a better Queenstown." You leave this Queenstown. Yeah, go to Queenstown. Go to a better one. Yeah, go Queenstown and on. There is a better Queenstown. Go on Queenstown. Not this one. Not delay. Not this one. Not delay. This one. Lena. This one. Le is for this place. Yeah, Lena. But there is a better one. The corner in the way. Is here. Ila, but not here. Not Ila. And when God redeems you, wow, he's gonna Kambula. take you to a better Queenstown. You will stay in this Queenstown, and Queenstown. you will not be like the people of this Queenstown. And they will ask you, "Where are you working?" You tell them, "I am working in a better Queenstown. I am staying in a better Queenstown. I worship in a better Queenstown. In a better South." Africa, Africa in a better Eastern Cape, in a better Eastern Cape, true redemption. That better Queenstown, that Queenstown and Mono has got all better things. In the Zonges Mono, I'm praying now. I want everybody today to leave this Queenstown. See, the Queenstown is got it has got a chaff gospel in a gospel a chaff, but that is a better Queenstown. What do I call the Queenstown for the redeemed one? For Abo Abo Shangulu, leave this one. See, leave this one. See, this one, Lena, is bound by a law by the spirit of the area. Lena, Ibanjo, Moya, went down. Leave this one. Yeah, Kelly. This one, Lena, has got gossipers. Lena, in a bad Leave this one. This one has got evil altars. This one has got witches. There is a better one. No witch will enter there. It's only for you. It's only for you. It's only for you. Your husband is there. Your wife is there. Your promotion is there. I declare it's your time. You are redeemed. To a better Queenstown. Woo! 
Thank you, Jesus. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. No, Tiko Loshe, that one. We walk there. We, are we walk there. We, are we, walk there. we walk there. We are We walk there. We walk there. We, are we enjoy there. Oh, we celebrate oh, there. Oh, we worship there. Oh, when we see them gossiping, we just listen to them and see them through the window. Why? Oh, we live here. But we are not of this way. There is a better place for us. We are redeemed to be made better. Lift your hands. A better place to redemption. Jesus. You are redeemed today. This queenstown has made you to suffer. But I'm taking you to the one that will make you to celebrate. You have been crying in this one. You desire a new land. You desire something new. You desire something new. Sing and I win you, Chris. Hey, hey, Jesus. Hey. Lift your hands and we pray. Paramus is on last year, Tandas. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. A better Queenstown. A Queenstown in A Lord. better South Africa. In South Africa in Lord. A better Eastern Cape. Eastern Cape. A Lord. better Western Cape. Better West in Western Woo! Cape. In Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In us, a better place. A better place. A better place. Leave the spirit of the area. Oh, yeah, in him. We have redemption. Mangalaban. What but you tell me, why are you so beautiful? We are hungry. Would you know? We no. I live in a better Queenstown. But you tell me now, and what's wrong with school? Why are you healthy? I live in a better Queenstown. I live in a better province. It is created by the Lord for redemption. You are redeemed. Yes, Thank you, Jesus. You are redeemed. Thank you, Jesus. Woo! This one has made you to cry. Some of you have lost their relatives in this Queenstown. Through COVID-19. There is a better one. It has got no tears. Only the praises. You will hear things through the veil. Because you are staying in another Queenstown. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. My Ali Saibaza. Thank you, Lord. Allah Zoka. Thank you, Jesus. Allah Zoka. Oh, you are to a new land. As we start a new year, we as the church, I prophesy a new Queenstown, a new anointing, a new level, a new diamond. Jesus. It's for you and me. Woo! Jesus. Woo! Spaka Mr. Salakon. Lift your hands. Sinomo <sighs> Shuta. Oh my god. I will never be a chaff. Gag and be chaff. I don't stay in this Queenstown. And Queenstown. I don't stay in this South Africa. And you are South African chief. There is a better South Africa. Call the South African on. There's no corruption there. corruption corner. There's no adultery to that one. That There's no lie there. Only the kings stay there. The prince and the princess. kings and queens. People who are made better. Oh! Thank you, Jesus. It's you and me. Go and nam. I want you to leave it this one. This one is old. Lena Indala. This one, Lena, is evil. This one, Lena, has got all your enemies. There is that one. 
It has got angels. That one. There that one. There is there is a there is a spirit, a cool spirit. When problems come, the anointing is released. In that one is an upper queen star. The queen star on a pezulu. Oh, thank you, Jesus. What differentiates a believer from another believer? The other one lives in a better place. We are all staying in Queenstown. But that is the better one. For those whom Jesus has redeemed. You walk there. You walk there. Once they read you that you are not working, it doesn't hit you. You know that your Redeemer lives. Give me Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Give me Holy Spirit. Help me, Holy Spirit. This is a place for you. What helped me to enjoy the place where God has called me? What causes me to enjoy this place? It's because though I'm called here, but I don't stay here, I'm staying there. I'm staying there, but here. I'm the pillar park I look at them like this. And begin. Oh God. When they talk, they talk at a distance. I hear them. They don't know me. Because I've got a better Queenstown. Queenstown and Still in Queenstown. I have come today to take you to the better Queenstown. Queenstown and you and your children. I say you and your children. In that Queenstown, Queenstown, your enemy cannot enter. Security is tight. Security is tight. One who touches you touches your God. There is no one to enter there. A door is opened for you. Lift up your hands. Thank you, Jesus. Maybe go and eat cake. cake. We'll go enjoy the cake. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody must pray a prayer. And say, Lord, I'm living this one. I have cried on this one. I have left my mother on this one. I lost my brother on this one. I want a new one. I leave this one. Lift your hands. Thank you. Stand on your feet. Woo. Thank you, Lord. Ah. I'm living this one. I am living this one. I'm redeemed. Lift your hands. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. Woo. Yours is just to say thank you, Jesus. For this better Queenstown you are introducing to me. Let the spirit of a better Queenstown touch my spirit. Not this old one. Thank you, Jesus. Lift your hands higher than that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, no, no, so come on. Hallelujah.